Hi everybody, Jay Martins here, and this week we are delving deep into the minds of creatives. And we've talked about how we observe the world around us and how we catalog all those ideas and keep those ideas fresh and in front of ourselves and, and using mood boards or what have you. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about the process. Now, every creative has a completely different process, and I respect that. But there's a couple of major steps that are always there. Most people that are under the age of 40 will pop headphones in when they're being creative, or when they're getting into the zone, or when they're studying their lines, or when they're doing what it is that they do. Music is such a huge, huge, huge mood factor. And that places you in a mood. Now, if you're actually creating music, then uh, things are a little bit different for you because you're probably like, you know, getting your comfy jammies and, and you feel comfortable and you feel like you're in the groove or you, or you feel that. And for most of us, the quickest way to get an emotion happening in our, in our, in our system is to put on some music that we associate with that emotion. So some people are into country, some people are into Bach, some people are into Brahms. We're not here to judge. But you know what? One thing is for certain. If you get that right song on at the right time, it gets you into that creative mood even quicker. And it gets you into a state of mind that's reflective of how you remember that song making you feel. And it's awesome. Use this to your advantage and listen to some tunes today. So as you're getting creative and as you're getting in that creative zone, listen to your tunes and turn it up a little bit. Don't tell your mama I told you that, but turn it up a little bit and enjoy the creative process. And we will see you tomorrow.